Hey, this is Paul Payton with Focal Splash, and Nick asked me to see if I can put this sky into this picture. Alright, so first thing would be to uh, hit the Move tool and drag this over and drop it right there. All right, obviously we're going to change the size a bit and just want it to probably look like that. Drop it down just below the horizon, maybe a little lower, something like that, and then hit enter and I'm done. All right, the next thing would be, uh, there's a lot of ways to do this, so I'm going to turn this layer off. I'm going to go back to this layer. I'm going to use the quick select tool by pressing W and make the tool a little bigger and just select this right here pretty simple selection and I'm gonna select this tree just like that I'm gonna go into select and mask and refine this selection on a tree I'm gonna hit T to make all that white and that's not how you refine it you hit the R to refine the selection obviously you can change it to white here you don't have to hit T and then uh, make the brush kind of big and just do this and it finds the tree right that's very cool isn't it so we're not going to need that detail there but then I'm going to hit W and just fill this in back here like that so we have the sky blank so on the selected mask at the bottom you hit uh, new layer with layer mask bang just like that we could move this layer under under it and put it like that that's a very fast quick way and it works with this picture you can adjust the uh, put a curves adjustment layer over the top of this and bring it down and maybe brighten the stars and then darken the darks you know something like that or if that's too much you know so you can play with the uh, maybe not so bright on the stars something like that um, and then we have we have the image pretty much done all right so let's look at a different way let's turn this back on we'll turn this layer back on here another way to do it is you know if you don't like that way which is for this image would be best um, you can Put a layer mask on the sky just by clicking right here and drop the opacity down and then with a brush you can paint with black and paint away what you don't want where you don't want the stars that's another way to do it it's basically the same the same thing but we're putting a layer mask on the different layer just like that and now the stars aren't below the horizon so that right there is pretty easy that's a way to do it